How's it going everyone? JKXVX here, we're back on Forza Horizon 5 with another video. As you may be aware, Xbox gave me the opportunity to play a limited version of Forza Horizon 5. It wasn't a demo, but it was single player only. There's a few unfinished things such as the car list still isn't final even in the version I was playing but nevertheless with my time with the game I have put a ton of content for together for you guys so make sure to subscribe as over the next few weeks tons of Horizon 5 content. Anyway, as you can imagine with a new Forza Horizon title there's a load of new stuff, there's new upgrades, new map locations, it's just a world of new stuff. Now one of the things we have more of and there's new ones of are engine swaps. It was one of the things that they told us a few months ago that Forza Horizon 5 is going to have hundreds of more engine swaps for tons of cars. Not necessarily meaning that there's going to be hundreds of engines you can put into a car. What they do mean is there's going to be hundreds of cars with more engine options, if that makes sense. Obviously in Horizon 5 there are new engine sounds as well. Now as you can tell by the title from now, what we're doing in today's video is going to very quickly show you the sound of every single engine swap possible in the game. I believe I've got them all, unfortunately I may be missing a few, however I looked for ages and I can't find any more. Now bear in mind that these cars you're going to see on screen are all engine swapped. The purpose of the video is not the car that I'm driving, rather it's the engine sound that you can hear. For example, one of the cars you're going to see is the Impreza with this 6.2 litre V8. The point of this is to show you what the 6.2 litre V8 engine swap sounds like. Whatever car you put this 6.2 litre V8 engine swap into, that's what it'll sound like. Does that make sense? Now first up we're going to start with all of the V8 engine swaps which are possible. This contains the following, a 6.2 litre V8, a 7 litre V8, 5.2 litre V8, a 7.2 litre V8, a 6.7 litre V8 turbo diesel, a racing 7.2 2 litre V8, a 3 litre racing V8 and a 3.5 litre V8 twin turbo. All of these are engine swaps which you can put into certain cars. Let's take a listen to all of them now.
Next up, we have the V10 engines. Now, there's not as many of these. We have the 5.2 litre, the 4.8 litre, the 5 litre, and the 8.4 litre V10 engines, which can all be put in certain cars. This is what they sound like. Next up, we have the V12 engine swaps. We have quite a few of these. We've got the 7.7 .7 litre V12, the 6.1 litre V12, the 6.5 litre V12, the 6.9 litre V12, and the racing V12. Let's take a listen to all of them now.
Next up, we have the V6s. Now, I could only find one of these. If there's more than one that I'm about to show you, then I added it in at a later time when I found it. But for the moment, we have the 3.8 litre V6 twin turbo, which is obviously the Nissan GTR engine. Let's take a listen. Next up, we have the inline six options. There's only a few of these. We have the racing three liter inline six turbo. We have the 2.6 liter inline six twin turbo and the 3.2 liter inline six. These are all of the inline six engine swaps. Let's take a listen. Next up, we have the inline four engines. We have the two liter inline four, the 1.6 liter inline four turbo rally. Let's see what these sound like. Next up we have the flat engines, the flat fours and the flat sixes. We're going to have the 2 litre flat four turbo rally and the 4 litre flat six. Let's see what those sound like. And last but not least, we have these special engines. We have the inline four motorbike engine and the 2.6 litre four rotor racing engine. Let's take a listen to them.
Those are pretty much all of the engine swaps that I could find in Forza Horizon 5 and that's what they sound like. So let me know which one you think improved the most, which one you think should have been improved a bit more and which one you think sounds the best. I think some of the high litre V8s sound pretty cool in my opinion and all the V10s sound good as well. They've certainly nailed them. And the motorbike engine, there's just so many good ones. Anyway guys, make sure to keep an eye out on the channel, we've got plenty more Horizon 5 content coming. Leave a like if you've enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already. For more Horizon 5 content, and I'll see you all later.